Francis has been in the HIV prevention and care field since 2006 and has worked diligently to improve the lives of patients living with HIV. He approaches his work with passion, dedication, and heart. For these reasons, the City of West Hollywood is proud to present Francis Ocon with the 2022 Paul Andrew Stark Warrior Award. Hi everyone. I want to start off by saying mabuhay uh, and good evening. Mm -hmm. The word mabuhay in the Philippines means long live. Mm -hmm. um, growing up as a gay kid in the Philippines, I've always wanted to become one day to be Miss Universe because <laughs> <laughs> because it allowed a young woman to have a platform to speak about advocacies that they are near and dear to their heart. Fortunately for me, uh, the higher powers have bigger plans. Mm -hmm. I got my nursing degree and got my license, and now I guess I'm a fierce warrior for people living with <laughs> HIV and AIDS. <laughs> so thank you for that option. <laughs> to kind of understand this, <laughs> uh, I, allow me to say a little bit about my background. I migrated to the U.S. in 1987. I was 12 years old. I grew up not knowing how it felt to be loved, um, encouraged to dream big, or be guided just with life's problems and obstacles. Uh, it was a rough upbringing, to say the least, um, but I would not change anything about it because of five things. One, it allowed me to mature at a young age. Two, it taught me to always be compassionate and kind because we never really know what somebody who is next to us is going through. Um, three, it helped me develop a sense of uh, humor that has both been called nippy, snippy, <laughs> but it's coming from a great place. It's coming from the heart. Um, four, it taught me to be independent and live my life with no regrets, just lessons learned. But most importantly, it gave me the courage to be unapologetically myself to whomever I meet on a daily basis. I want to thank the executive team at Mental Foundation, Dr. Mills and Dr. Robinson, uh, for your support. To the public programs team, Carlos, who's not here today, but my former boss, Rob. Caitlin, where are you? Thank you so much to lovely Caitlin um, for the nomination and for providing me with a platform that I didn't have because I didn't win Miss Universe, right? <laughs> so you gave me a platform that allowed me to show my patients, our patients, that they are valued and that they matter. To my nursing colleagues and friends who have traveled many miles to be here, thank you for shaping me to be this Simply amazing and humble person. <laughs> <laughs> to the nursing counselor and instructor that told me that nursing is not for me. <laughs> <laughs> to my loving and supportive and talented husband and our four baby Sean Cody. <laughs> Mahal na mahal na mahal ko kayong dalawa, which means I love you both very, very much. And finally, to all my MCC patients who feels they have lost their power, I want you to know you are loved. Allow us the privilege to guide you. You are the true warriors in this game called life. Regain your power, be proud, and always be you. Long live and... Abu Hay! <laughs>